हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू क्रिएटिव लर्न चैनल हियर आई एम गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू आवर एक्सरसाइज फ्रॉम सेकंड चैप्टर मल्टीप्लाई एंड डिवाइड ओके हियर इज वन टेबल कंप्लीट द फॉलोइंग टेबल हियर वन टेबल गिवन एंड दिस टेबल कंसिस्ट ऑफ थ्री कॉलम्स फर्स्ट वन प्रॉब्लम क्वेश्चंट रिमाइंडर ओके फर्स्ट कॉलम it is about problem and the second column we have to write here question and third column we have to write the remainder here how can we get question and remainder here is the problem when we divide 300 by 100 what is the question may be that one we have to write here and the what is the remainder may be there that one we have to write here this is simply about table okay shall we start now first question 300 divided by 100 300 divided by 100 okay we can do the problem here 300 this is the divided divided by 100 so 100 we have to write right side now in 100 table when we get 300 how many times 100 threes are 300 so directly i am writing here 100 3s are 300 now we have to subtract 300 minus 300 it's a zero so what is the quotient here 3 is the quotient and what is the remainder here zero is the remainder simply we can write here we have to write here okay 3 is the quotient and zero is the remainder same for the next problem also we should we should write like this only 425 divided by 100 okay let's do the division here 425 this is the dividend and what is the divisor 100 is the divisor now we have to divide 425 by 100 now in 100 table shall we get 425 not possible then what we get only 400 How many times that one? Four times. Hundred four is a four hundred. Now, now we have to subtract. Starts from ones place. Five minus zero, it's five. Two minus zero, it's two. And the four minus four, it's zero. So what is the remainder here? Twenty five is the remainder. For easy identification, I am writing here. Four is the quotient. And twenty-five is the remainder. Now we suppose to write here. What is the quotient? Four is the quotient. When we divide four hundred and twenty-five by hundred, and what is the remainder here? Twenty-five is the remainder. Now next move to the next question. Six hundred and eighty-two divided by hundred. Again we have to do the division. Six hundred and eighty-two. Is the dividend, and what is the divisor here? Hundred is the divisor. In hundred table, can we get six hundred and eighty two? No, not possible. Then what we get in hundred table? Less than six hundred and eighty two. That is six hundred. How many times? It's six times. So hundred six is six hundred. Now we have to do the subtraction again. Starts from. Ones place two minus zero, it's two. Eight minus zero, it's eight. And six minus six, it's zero. So what is the remainder here? Eighty-two. Eighty-two is the remainder. And what is the quotient here? Six is the quotient. Simply we can write these two here in the table. Okay, quotient is six, and eighty-two is the remainder. And the next one. Eight hundred and ten divided by hundred. Eight hundred and ten divided by hundred. Here, eight hundred and ten is the dividend. Hundred is the divisor. So again, in hundred table, we may not get eight hundred and ten. So what we get in hundred table? That's eight hundred. How many times? Eight times. Hundred eight is eight hundred. We have to do the subtraction again here. Zero minus zero, it's zero. One minus zero, it's one. Eight minus eight, it's zero. So what is the remainder here? That is ten. 
and what is the quotient here that is 8 we can write simply in the table quotient 8 and remainder 10 okay here if we observe all these four rows first when 300 divided by 100 what we get quotient 3 means 100 plus digit and what is the remainder 0 means remaining number and when 425 divided by 100 what is the quotient same 100 plus digit is the quotient and remaining number is the remainder here also 100 plus digit is the quotient and remaining number is the remainder here also 8 is the quotient and 10 is the remainder same for the next one also we can simply write blindly quotient is the 100 plus digit that is 9 when 905 divided by 100 quotient is the 9 and what is the remainder that is 5 0 5 means it's 5 okay next 1500 divided by 100 first two ones place tens place is 0 so remainder is 0 so what is the remaining thing in 100 place it is 5 and in 1000 place 1 all this is the 15 because here how many hundreds there 15 hundreds there so 15 hundreds 15 hundreds divided by 100 means how many hundreds here 15 that is the quotient and remaining 0 is the remainder shall we check whether it is right or wrong simply we can do here 15 100 is the dividend and 100 is the divisor now we have to do the division 100 in 100 table when we get 1500 we don't know but when we get 150 that one also we don't know what we get 100 shall we write here 100 ones are 100 now do the subtraction 0 minus 0 it's 0 5 minus 0 it's 5 and 1 minus 1 it's 0 but again right side one another digit is there so we have to drag this digit and write down now it becomes 500 now in 100 table when we get 500 that is 5 times so 100 is 500 500 minus 500 it's 0 is there any another digit right side not there so this is the remainder 0 is the remainder and 15 is the quotient already we wrote here so this is the right one whatever may be how many hundreds there that is the quotient and what else remainder uh, what else remaining there that is the remainder simply we can write how many hundreds here 43 hundreds so quotient is the 43 and what is remain here 20 so that is the remainder if you have any doubt you can check by division here also how many hundreds here 5002 means how many hundreds here ones tens hundreds and it's thousands total 50 hundreds there so 50 is the quotient and 2 is the remainder because in all these questions divisor is the hundred that's why we are writing simply or else we have to do the division again okay here also in 6123 we can also read like 6123 so how many hundreds here 61 hundreds there so quotient is the 61 and what is remainder here 23 is the remainder and in 7999 we can also name like 7999 so what is the quotient 79 and what is the remainder remaining number 99 that becomes remainder i hope you all understand if you have any doubt comment below ee video nu veekshinchinanduku dhanyavaadalu ee video meeku nachinatlaite like cheyandi share cheyandi maa tadupari video lanu veekshinchadaniki subscribe cheskodam marchipokandi Thanks for watching our video. Please like, share and subscribe.